Karen? Ah, Jake, good morning, good morning. Now, please take a seat. Thanks for coming to the office. I, I thought best we do this face to face. Is there a problem, Doctor? Oh God, cancer? No, 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 no. Nothing, nothing like that. Nothing like that. Look, I'll be quite honest with you, Jake. I've never seen anything quite like this before. I was so shocked by my diagnosis that I referred it to some friends of mine, colleagues on the East Coast. I mean, we're talking about some of the finest medical minds in the world here. They did their own diagnostics. Unfortunately, they all came up with the same conclusion. Am I going to die? Jake, all of us are going to die someday. What does the poet say? He says, therefore, send not to know for Ooh, the bell tolls. It tolls for me. However, here's the good news. If you follow my prescription, you are in with every bit of a chance like the rest of us, despite your condition. So, what do I have to do? Jake, you going to have to start smoking. Pack of lights? Lights? Please. You sure? Excuse me? You are aware that there is less tar in light cigarette. Am I missing something here? You don't read the news, do you, boy? New studies show increased levels of tar and carbon monoxide actually promote well-being. They had it right back in the 50s, what do you know, huh? <laughs> the stronger cigarette is the healthier choice. What new studies? You been living in a cave? Just a pack of lights, okay? All right. It's your body. Jake, you got the Fletcher file ready? You know we present on Friday. Yeah, yeah, I'll have it done, no problem, Mr. Stevens. You going somewhere? I'm just gonna go outside for a quick cigarette. You're gonna go outside for a cigarette? Yeah, I'm sorry, is that okay? Well, sure, but why not just smoke right here at your desk? We are trying to maximize efficiency. Do you need a light? Thanks. Can somebody get Jake an ashtray. Let's get back to work, people. Good things. Drive it, drive it, drive it. Get it, get it. Good go. Two more, two more. Boom, drive it up, drive it up. There you go, last one, last one. Man up on this, push it, push it. Come on, come on. All right, all right. That was a pretty good go, man. Oh man, I should have lifted on my own by now. Yeah, don't even worry about it. Maybe what you need is just a little boost. Steroids? Steroids. No woman wants a man with shriveled nuts. Talk about this. Uh, you take a drag of that, and we'll kill this next set.
Hey, Mom. Oh, darling. <laughs> Mike, your son's home. <laughs> Jake, you've not been smoking, have you? Oh, hey, Dad. Hello, son. <laughs> now, what's all this I hear about smoking? Yeah, nothing, Dad. You are smoking. I knew it. Ah, the number of times I left a pack lying around just hoping you'd reach for one. I told you his voice sounded nice and gravelly over the phone. Hey, come here, son. Come here. I'm proud of you, buddy. Yeah, I just remember something, guys. I, I've got to go. Oh, come on in. You just got here. I've got supper on it's your favorite smoked salmon. Uh, I already ate. Um, I'm sorry. I've, i got to go. Hey, I, I, I'm proud of you, son. Our little boys all grown up. The seat taken? So, um, I'm not usually like this. But I just, uh, I saw you sitting here smoking that cigarette. You just look so damn sexy that I just had to come over. I hope you don't mind. My God, I don't even smoke.